I uh, didn't have a good time trial yesterday. It was it was uh, okay, but uh, according to my standards, not not up there. Um, so it was always a, a plan to try and go for a break. It would have been nice if, if there was one or two more guys with me. Um, it was unbelievably hard uh, up front there. Well done to Bonitas and Europco, who obviously put their whole teams on the or their full team teams on the front to chase me down. Um, you know, at the finish here it was only about 10, 15 guys. So um, if, the, if the numbers are small like that, it must have been hard in the bunch as well. So at least I walk away with the King of the Mountains jersey. So it's, it's the effort wasn't uh, was at least worth something. Uh, I take something away. Indeed. Obviously, as, as one of two Alti Auto Page riders in the tour, it's, it's very hard. No big team behind you, isn't it? Yeah, look, we mostly a mountain bike team, so this is uh, basically a nice training block for us. Tony Harding with the Pretoria box guys asked uh, us if we could, could join them and uh, help the young guys out a bit. And I mean, so far, the guys have been doing a good job. And obviously today was a school day for them to watch, to watch you go up the road, hey? It was quite interesting. And uh, and do you think, and, and what are your thoughts? Like, did, did, you, was that, did you plan to stay away? Were you trying to stay away to the end? What were you hoping for out of today's day? I actually didn't want to go away by myself. Um, the first time gap I got was about a minute, and then eventually it went up to or close to four minutes, I think. And uh, I knew the last King of the Mountain was on 90 kilometers on the top of Long Tom Pass. And at the bottom of Long Tom, Long Tom Pass, I had three minutes. So I basically just rode up there and uh, waited for the guys in the back. It's Tomorrow's another day, is no use. I killed myself trying to stay away. It was also a bit of a headwind coming back to the stadium, so it would have always been, you know, would have been very, very difficult to stay away till the finish. I mean, today's sort of a queen stage, but tomorrow again, another tough day, another two very big climbs looming with boulders and hilltop, especially. What are your thoughts going into that? Yeah, look, I've never done this new this new route. This uh, is a new jock route. So uh, tomorrow's stage is basically just boulders and yield top. But after boulders, it's it's undulating and it's it drags up all the way into Barberton. It's it's not an easy road. It's a draining road. It'll drain you after after boulders till the finish. It'll be difficult, very difficult road. Um, from what I saw today, it's...